bad. Why, hello there. Today we're going to examine the Beaverton High School caste system and how it relates to Indians caste system. As we saw in the book, God of Small Things, there is a subset of social structure which outlines the interactions and behavior of the individuals within the system. In Beaverton High School, we have four major student groups. First are the freshmen, who may can be considered to be called the untouchables of the system. Then we have the sophomores, and those two groups together consist of the underclassmen. I'm a freshman. It sucks being a freshman. Always get the short end of the stick. I have to sit in the lower cafeteria. No one respects us. It sucks. Observe as the sophomore tries to sit in the upper cafeteria. This is a very rare event because it is not allowed. He looks around carefully to see if there's anyone around. He slowly approaches hey, and the security guard. <laughs> I was just coming up to the cafeteria. I, I really don't belong here. I was just, just trying to say hi. I don't, I don't even know. From there, we have the juniors and the seniors, and the seniors may be viewed as the top of the caste system within the student body. Being a junior is pretty nice. I mean, I'm not an underclassman. I'm not a senior yet, you know, so I gotta respect the seniors, but I'm close, you know, one more year. I like the fact that I can be filmed in this nice, comfortable room with comfy ass chairs, you know, some acclimate weather. I'm perfectly comfortable. Um, I appreciate that I'm not being filmed in a garbage can like the freshmen. And you know, I got one more year left until I'm a senior, and then um, you know, I'm good to go. I'm on the top of school. So, okay. right here, we're in the library. We're looking at some specimens to see the social caste system in action. Right here, you have the wondrous Cam Harris. I think we've been spotted. <laughs> I'm Cam Harris. I'm a senior, and I live life on top. There's nothing I love better than just being the most respected man. How can you not respect this luxury of life? Beyond that, we have the teachers, administration, and principal even. You may even consider the counselors or the college and career center women to be part of the caste system. With the amount of time spent together, the interactions between these different groups is very, very prevalent and very seen over the four years. The development of the caste system is different in Beaverton High School than in India because through time you progress higher in the caste system. You're, you're, there's almost a subcaste system in each group with grade level. One must look at three aspects. First, um, the physical appearance, appearance of one. Two, the extracurriculars. And three, the GPA of someone to determine where they sit within their class ranking. I'm part of the Beaverton caste system and while I'm not the upper echelon of the caste system, I'm definitely up there. I do have to kind of listen to Miss Irwin. She's more at the top of the caste system here and maybe the vice principals. I do have servants, for example, Emma Gregwire is currently my TA and she is um, an excellent servant, although she does not get paid. She gets paid with high fives and thumbs up. Um, some of her duties are to do my dirty work like all of my copying and entering grades in the grade book. Um, I lord over this classroom, 202. You can see there's not many in here today, but you can see my view. My position in this system, in the caste system, allows me this wonderful view of the West Hills. Hi, I'm Mrs. Irwin. I'm the principal and this is my school. I'm in charge of everything. Everywhere the light touches, I'm in charge of. And now I'm bored, so I declare this video Five seconds. I'm a freshman. <laughs> oh, <laughs> perfect. Hold on. Yeah.